welcome to our weekly series on mental health entitled, Are You Healthy? I am Caroline Chola, the Director of Women at the Southern Africa Indian Ocean Division of the Seventh-day Adventist Church, which is situated in Pretoria. In the next four presentations, which will come every Thursday, we will try to define what mental health really is. What is mental health? Mental health includes emotional, psychological, and social well-being. It also affects how we think, how we feel, and how we act. It also helps determine how we handle stress, relate to others, and make choices in life. Mental health is important at every stage of life, from childhood, adolescence, throughout to adulthood. Emotional and mental health is important to our lives because it is a vital part of our lives, our thoughts, our behaviors, and emotions. Being emotionally healthy can promote productivity, effectiveness in activities like work, school, and even caregiving. It plays an important part of health in our relationships. It allows us to adapt to changes in our life and cope with adversity. In order to determine whether we are mentally healthy, we need to do the following. Identify the components of health. Attempt to define mental health. Identify the determinants of mental health. And then consider some of the mental health conditions which can promote mental health well-being, including self-esteem. It is important to note that mental health is holistic and consists of many components. These are physical, emotional, spiritual, mental, sexual, environmental, and societal. These strands are closely related and deeply interconnected. Therefore, ill health in one facet can have repercussions in another aspect of life. The Bible says in 3 John 1, and I'm reading from the New King James Version, the Bible says, Beloved, I pray that you may prosper in all things and in health, just as your soul prospers. This is God's ideal for mankind. However, in our sin-polluted environment, disease is inevitable. We are aware that degeneration can be swift and rapid. Therefore, how can we be mentally healthy in this generation? Let us first consider the question, what is mental health? Mental health is not mental health illness. When one considers the term mental, it often has a negative connotation. We frequently hear people say you are mental. But we are all mental beings with mental needs. Therefore, what is mental health? Mental health is not easy to define. Because values differ from cultures, from individuals, and from subgroups. Therefore, what it means to be mentally healthy is subject to many different interpretations which are rooted in value judgments that may vary across cultures. Mental health is a concept that refers to human, individuals, emotional, and psychological well-being. It is the balance between all aspects of life, 
social, physical, spiritual, and emotional. It impacts on how we manage our surroundings, how we make our choices in our lives, and in an integral part of our overall health. The Webster's Dictionary defines mental health as a state of emotional and psychological well-being in which an individual is able to use his or her cognitive and emotional capabilities, function in society, and meet the ordinary demands of everyday life. Mental health is a state of well-being where you realize your own capabilities. You realize you can cope with the normal stresses of life. You realize you can work productively and fruitfully and you are able to make a contribution to your community. Mental health is the successful performance of mental function resulting in productive activities, fulfilling relationships with other people, and the ability to adapt to change and cope adversity from early childhood until late life. Mental health is a springboard of thinking and communication skills, learning emotional growth, resilience, and self-esteem. Mental health is the emotional and spiritual resilience which enables you and me to enjoy life and survive pain and disappointment, even sadness. However, mental health can be described in different ways. And these are psychological well-being, psychological health, psychosocial well-being, wellness, well-being, positive mental health, and emotional health. What is our take-home message? Our take-home message is mental health is not mental illness. We are mental beings with mental needs. Let us pray together. Our Father and our God who art in heaven, we thank you for this definition of mental health. Dear Lord, indeed, you created us with mental capabilities which we may not know and which we did not discover. There are many times when we did not use our mental faculties to the best of our ability. My Father and my God, help us to take care of our mental health now that we know what mental health is all about. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Join me next week as we look at the determinants of mental health.